Di sesi kedua ini sudah ada bersama kita pelatih dan perwakilan pemain dari Arema FC. Ada Kus Eduardo Almeida dan pemain Muhammad Taufik. Mungkin di kesempatan pertama ini bisa langsung kepada Kus Eduardo sedikit memberikan komentar terkait dengan hasil yang didapat. Okay, selamat malam. Uh, okay, the game uh, in the first half, we I think we are superior. Uh, we know we're going to be a very hard game, but we in the first half we we are better. We was go to the to the half time winning 2-1 and play very good. And the second half we come the spirit to to score the, another more goal and win the match. But after the the, the things change with the, when the, our player take the the red card and in that moment everything change. We have to adjust to the opponent, try to 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 save the the the, the, the advantage that we have, and in a counter attack or to counter attack uh, score score the goal number three. And in the end of the game, we we have two or three corners, and, and we sh we have the chance to 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 Recording in progress. to win the match or, or at least try to win. But I think the moment of the game is the red card, and everything changes uh, from there. Uh, selamat malam, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh uh, Pendapatnya ya hampir sama kayak yang dibilang sama Kutsal Meida Kita mengawali laga dengan ya sangat baik, uh, unggul 2-0 uh, Mungkin di akhir-akhir babak pertama kita sedikit lengah Jadi bisa masukkan 2-1 uh, Dan ya namanya sepak bola kita nggak bisa menyalakan kartu merah kartu merah itu pasti terjadi sepak bola jadi uh, itu sesuatu yang normal lah jadi uh, alhamdulillah kita uh, yang penting alhamdulillah kita masih bisa paling nggak bawa pulang satu poin uh, itu aja cukup oke okay, terima kasih oke okay, coach untuk pertanyaan pertama coach sudah ada pertanyaan dari Rizal Adi Pratama coach selama ini tiga kartu merah untuk lini depan Arema di putaran pertama dan akhirnya selalu menggagalkan kemenangan Arema Oke, nanti kita Ya, ya, understand, ya. Thank you. Uh, yeah, what I can say, um, in this, today the, the, I think that they make two faults uh, and it was take two yellow cards and red card. Uh, I see, with all respect, I see also other players make two faults and I don't see the red card. So. But we have to accept the, the, the decision of of the, um, the referee. Okay, uh, I know I know talk about the referees, and I will not talk today. But of course, for us already, yes, correct. Three games uh, playing a long time with uh, with ten months, but uh, we do our best when 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 we are in that situation. Is what we done uh, done today. Of course, we want to win, but after the red card, I have to consider all the effort that the, the team made. One point, uh, we win one point, and uh, and it is uh, it is uh, good for us according to the situation of the game. Of course, affect uh, affect everything. Uh, we we cannot uh, we cannot play face to face with uh, with uh, one man less because uh, it's difficult. So we have to adjust to the opponent and 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 make the strategy to 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 hold to try to to control our goal and in one or two situation go out and try a counter attack. Of course, this this change everything. One red card, one team playing with ten is totally different. We have one more less, one man less. So we have to adjust to more to the opponent and forget, uh, find another strategy to arrive the goal. Of course, affect affect a lot. Okay, let's follow the arena. Selama hari kedua ini. Evaluasi Arema is what is the name is correct. I think we are evaluation day by day. We are we make also. Uh, I think from the start the team is going up. We are more consistent. We are more more um, experienced. The players are more more um, have more chemistry, and this is normal because it's uh, it's for this that we work uh, every day. And I think the team win the second. In the second um, city, uh, we should, we, I think we can, by the, 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 this game, we, we like to go with uh, one more win, but the, the reality also we not lost, so we are making points every match. Coach, dua gol yang diciptakan Persebaya berawal dari kelengahan di lini belakang area. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, uh, no, no, agree. Uh, the, the, no, because uh, the situation was a good cross 
and and of course the, for happen goals have to happen mistakes and uh, the, the is the, the, we know that the strongest one of the strongest point is is the cross for for the, the opponent and put many men in the box <laughs> and uh, and of course we we know that and we, but in that time it's happened one time they they cross one time so we close many times but of course for have goals have to have mistakes also for we score goals the other team have to make mistakes so this is football we cannot close everything and uh, and the second goal is a big shot from outside of the box and 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 the ball hit i don't know where i think uh, i just it was a rocket i don't know where the ball hit and 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 there's a good goal Akhir mungkin kepada Rafi, untuk Rafi, Rafi, sejauh ini di seri kedua bagaimana menilai performa tim dan sebagai pemain yang sudah puas? Uh, melihat performa tim, uh, pastinya uh, ya udah semakin meningkat ya setiap pertandingan kita uh, bareng-bareng terus setiap pertandingan kita makin meningkat sama yang kayak dikatakan Rus Eduardo dari chemistry dari kompakan dari kemampuan dari skill semua kita makin hari makin meningkat lah jadi uh, tapi kalau dibilang puas pasti uh, kita nggak boleh puas sih kita harus uh, terus meningkatkan kemampuan kita uh, chemistry kita semuanya jadi uh, ya uh, jangan puas dulu lah pokoknya harus tetap uh, meningkat gitu.